for you. Um, we'll be hearing very shortly from Todd Stern, who has arrived, who was the negotiator of the Paris Agreement, the Obama administration climate negotiator, and has been in the international trenches on fighting climate change for a long time. And I think the Paris Agreement still remains the high point of international activity, notwithstanding uh, our current president's comments about it. And that's much credit to uh, Todd and his years working. Uh, we'll be hearing from Sam Waterston, who you probably think of as being uh, from Newsroom, uh, or uh, I'll Fly Away, or Chiching, Long Order. But he's also on the board of Oceana and has, is a very, very committed oceans uh, advocate. And of course, Secretary <laughs> Kerry, who has really led uh, the International Oceans Initiative and was the guiding force behind making the Paris deal come true, uh, will be joining us. I could not be prouder to have my old colleague, Secretary Kerry, uh, joining us. Um, and of course, we have a lot of great state uh, officials and leaders here as well. And I will take a moment to turn the microphone over right now to and welcome uh, Seth Magaziner, who has our treasurer has worked very hard to make sure that green infrastructure plays a big role in the infrastructure bank. And as the voting voice of our uh, pension fund has also been very supportive of shareholder actions uh, in fossil fuel companies. And I will say that although there are times when things look a little grim <coughs> as you look at Administrator Pruitt or uh, Secretary Perry, or some of the characters that are being put into these positions of authority, there are also some pretty remarkable new things happening. And one, which really just happened for the first time this year, is that after years and years and years of the big oil companies fending off every single shareholder initiative on climate change, we first broke the back of Occidental Petroleum, and then we broke the back of Exxon Mobil. And that's thanks to the leadership of big investors like uh, BlackRock and Goldman Sachs and others, but it's also thanks to the work of our treasurers. Seth, say a word. <laughs> 